Hare Krishna. My name is Arav Gupta and today I am going to talk about the topic Spirit of the Bhagavad Gita. The Bhagavad Gita or the Gita as it is popularly known is part of the epic Mahabharata. The epic describes the war between the Pandavas and the Kauravas on the battlefield of Kurukshetra. Arjuna's dilemma begins when he realizes that the enemy is family and he feels the impact of killing family on society as a whole. The Gita is the discourse given by Krishna to Arjuna just before the war is about to begin. The Gita V over here is essentially that which is narrated by a man with no authority but infinite sight, Sanjay, to a man with full authority, but no sight, Dhritarashtra. Krishna and Sanjay may speak exactly the same words, but while Krishna knows what he is talking about, Sanjay does not. Krishna is a source, while Sanjay is merely a transmitter. Arjuna is a seeker. So he decodes what he hears to find a solution to his problem. The truth according to the Gita is like a cake. Everyone has access to a slice, but the one who sees all slices of truth is Bhagwan. Limited truth is Mithya. Limitless truth is Satya. The journey towards limitless truth Pants our mind. After concluding his counsel, Krishna asked Arjuna to reflect on what has been said and then do as he feels. To summarize, one must accept the Bhagavad Gita as it is, as Lord Krishna said to Arjuna. No addition or delation to his 